you are joking. No. I'll do. Now then. Kind of um, a special one because I've finished my tea cab. But not only have I finished my tea cab, um, a few of you guys already know and people I talk to at the clubs. And as it's Father's Day, and for the last 12 months, I've actually been building this up for my dad for this Father's Day. Now, a lot of you will know who's already in my Facebook group and stuff that I've um, been asking bits and bats and opinions on like what I should do or if I have an idea with something, how should I go about it or what do you think of this if I go with this idea or that idea. And the feedback from everyone was great. I've had loads of feedbacks and everyone's different opinions on what they think would work and what they wouldn't work. Um, and my dad, he's actually, I'd say, my biggest fan on YouTube. He comments on all my videos, watches all my videos, gives them a like, shares them all. Um, and in the group, he also put his opinions as, as well to what I think I should do with it, i.e. like the colours and stuff, and down to stack egg sauce, whether I have the big pipes or these, and just everything and I've took my dad's opinion for the whole build any question I've asked I've just took what my dad thinks now my dad likes the teacabs he absolutely loves the Scania teacab he's got a huge 150 collection of, um, yeah a huge 150 scale collection of teacabs and I just thought um, it'd just be nice to can't fucking do this. <laughs> Sorry about that. Just there. Um... Yeah, I thought it'd be nice for um, him to have his favourite truck, like built basically to his specification. Um, me and my dad are model building, we go back to Blimmin' since I was so big building airfix kits and stuff. And then we used to tour all truck fest together, so. We've always shared this passion with model building and trucks, regardless. And uh, as you get older, you might get a little bit ill or something. And I don't know, life's short. So I just thought it'd be nice to pay my dad back for a good 33 year of my life so far. And give him this. So, you'll be watching this now, Dad, um, and I'll continue with the video because we'll, you'll see me give it to him anyway later on, well tomorrow, we're uh, just packing up for the national meeting now. So yeah, this is for me Dad, uh, I'll let you have a little look at it, and then I'm going to just sign under the bonnet. So, this is what I've done so far. I have just knocked the window out, so I do have to just quickly screw that back in. Well, I've just made a little bit of a cabin in there and a bed and... It's not running yet. He will have to provide his own remote. Sorry, Dad, but I'm on a budget and this is the best you're getting. All you need to do is provide a remote and uh, we do need to cut and sort the prop shaft out because I don't have the tools for that, so it's almost ready to run. Um, all the lights are pre-wired in here everywhere and to the rears and the lights you know all comes everywhere so that's so he has, he has his option because I know he's, he likes his servonauts and his ML4s and stuff 
to control the lights so I didn't really know whether to put a basic light kit in or have it on switches so I've put all the lighting in and that's basically down to his choice um, the crawler motor in there just to slow it down now I've gone with the blue that I have in my fleet um, I did ask one of the questions where do I go half and half with the grey and blue and a lot of people said yeah and my dad said all blue so it's all blue it does have the gunmetal chassis um, it's got the Tamiya Matt Alley wheels some of the Kirk centre caps amber flashing beacons, the air horns the top light bar that's all that wired in and fitted there's the for Kirk mirrors on there um, Jerome's bonnet Philberg chassis infill with like the lockers cut out and stuff and just a set of stacks up top Oops, sorry up the back well no I think he'll be really 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 suited for this really suited I've been under pressure getting this built because I've wanted it right but I felt like I've had a deadline with Father's Day approaching so <laughs> it's been quite chaotic so let's see So, um, yeah, we'll catch up with you guys tomorrow when we're at the meet at National in uh, Cambridge, God Manchester. This should be a good day, and uh, I'll give it to him there. The only reason I'm not giving it him on Father's Day is because we have my own plans with my own children. So, we're already doing stuff with us. So, you can have it a little bit early in case I don't get the chance on the Sunday. So, yeah, um, I'll check back with you guys then. Ciao for now. Bye -bye. So we're here at the national meet. Oh yeah. Well, Papa's father's day present. <laughs> He's here. <laughs> this big meet. Alright, so there's the uh, tea cab in there. So we're gonna go and give it to my dad now. Yeah, we'll do. Hey. <laughs> Cheers. There's plenty more. In this box, it's your Father's Day present. Now, I'll give it you tomorrow, but... I don't know what time I've got or anything, but uh, well, you'll be you'll be coming and picking her up, won't you? Well, I, I, you can have it here, though. It's but it's oh, uh, I'm just uh, dealing with a customer. I'll just be a moment. You got any ideas what it could be? I'm to clear. I'm to clear. Right. Um, <laughs> right. It's just, no, I, I'm not supposed to guess. Well, if you don't know, you don't know, do you? I'll, I'll give you some of those. Can you three months on my? Oh yeah. You don't right, want it in. Right. You're joking. Every time I've asked in the group for an opinion, I've took your opinion and built it to how you'd want it. You are joking. No. And that's just thanks for me uh, 33 years so far. Because. <laughs> Alright. Sorry, I started well enough when I was doing the introduction on video yesterday and that, but... Oh shit, I would have said all that. It's alright. <laughs> but yeah. So, happy Father's Day.
Jerusalem, but we 